Ah, a beautiful knobby piano. I'm Robert Estrin. This is livingpianos.com. Did you know that knobby was the official piano of the Metropolitan Opera and a choice of so many musicians? This is a really special piano because it was made in 1941. Now, why is that so special? Well, did you know that pianos were not made during World War II? In fact, Nearly all the piano factories converted to wartime efforts. So this was one of the last pianos to come off the line before several years when no pianos were made in the United States. And better than that, this piano was restored a few years ago, refinished. I'm going to tell you all about that, but first I'm going to sail into the B minor scherzo, Chopin's first scherzo, and then I'm going to skip to the, the bombastic coda for you. Hope you enjoy it. What's so great about American pianos from the golden age like this instrument is how much energy you can put into them and never get a harsh sound. You try this on a lesser piano and you'll get distortion, kind of a, a tinny metallic edge when you put that kind of energy that I just put into this five foot two inch piano. Now there's a lot of reasons for that, the types of woods that are used, the quality of the hammers, the wide tail, just like on Mason and Hamlin, offers a larger soundboard area than in other pianos of its size. So you get this big, rich sound. Better than that, this piano does have new hammers, shanks, knuckles, key bushings, front rail bushings, strings, uh, damper felt, tuning pins, and the case has been refinished. And what a piece of furniture this is. You just don't see woods like this anymore, do you? It's a real pleasure. And to see the other side, the poetry that's possible with a beautifully regulated instrument like this and one that has newer parts. I'm going to play this gorgeous little piece I love to teach. And it's a, by a Cacciaturian. It's a little um, melody, an andantino, and I think you'll like.
So that shows you two sides of what's possible on a great restored American piano. I hope you've enjoyed this. And once again, I'm Robert Estrin here at livingpianos.com, your online piano resource. See you next time.